Okay, before you go, name one baseball player. Uh, Stephen Curry. What's up, guys? It's a it's a Tuesday afternoon. It's a Tuesday afternoon. Uh, everybody's working and all. But where are we going? We're gonna go play some baseball things. That's why, guys, be a YouTuber. You don't have to. Anyways, we were invited by Baseball Cage Center in uh, Puchong. Uh, they're like, yo, we have this this cool little place where you can go and like hit balls and shit. And I'm like, yeah, sure, bro. Let's let's go check it out. Which is why we are here. It's in Banda Putri Puchong. We're gonna go check it out. We're gonna hit some balls, do some challenges, probably. We'll see how it goes. And yeah, let's go. Who's that baseball? Baseball pitch. Let's go. So how does it work usually? Like what we just. So usually just get the token. Mm. And when you enter, it's like you have two boxes. Okay. Designated one. So that is for right-handed. Here's for left-handed. All right. So just they have four bats, two different sizes. Two is long and two is short. Okay. Then basically you just carry and swing. Alright, and then the balls are just okay. I'm yeah. sure we have like helmets and stuff yeah. like that. <laughs> it's free size, right, right? So the ball speed is 60 km. So we cannot change the speed and all this? Uh, one, because it's a small area, right? If you change the speed, it affects the height. If you change the height, it affects oh. the speed. Oh. So basically, just in thumb, just hit, hit, hit in here. Yeah. Alright, alright. There's no perfect swing. <laughs> As long as you don't hurt yourself and all that. Okay. But like the balls would just come come. No, no. <laughs> Few seconds, two seconds. Uh, then after you finish one token, you wait around 10 to 15 seconds. Mm -hmm. And then you insert the following token. Cool. I mean, let's try it out. Hey, there's two different baseball there's sides. One, this two is long, this two is short. The Honestly, long. I prefer the long one. So the pros use the longer one, right? Easier one. This is my first time actually holding like a baseball bat. Oh. Try. I think I can get the first shot. So basically, that's 15, 15 balls for each token, right? I'm guessing I'm gonna get at least. What? How many do you think I can get? Five. How many do you think I can get? Three. Five, three, seven. Okay. Okay. So that's me, 3 out of 15. Now we're gonna check, see how Nina does it. I'm gonna say 0 out of 15. Because I've seen how she plays badminton, it's the wet. That's true. <laughs> I'm a pro. Is it this side? Yeah, correct. Why does it look so weird? I don't know. I'm no. supposed to look. Wait, wait, wait. Tribali, that's Tribali. I think Tribali. Tribali, that's Tribali. Yeah. Eh? Eh, no, actually correct. <laughs> actually correct. The back one is correct. You know how you know? It's because like, the back wind goes yeah, that way. Yeah. Bernoulli's principle. You can just call it wind. No, no, man, it's the drag. Air drag. Physics. I didn't want to say that. that didn't, but it's strong. It didn't count. It didn't count. <laughs> they didn't count. They didn't even go there. It counts. No, you have to hit it. Come on. Come on. At this point, I didn't. Sexist. This whole thing is sexist. So basically, it's a tie around 3-3. Three, three. 3-3 How are you hitting all these things, man? Do you know why? Do you know why you got the balls? Let me, let me explain to you Do you know why she, she was able to play like a pro? Because she's a team rabbit, get yourself <laughs> uh, Round 2, after learning some techniques and strategy I feel right now I can go with 6 Okay, before you go, name one baseball player uh, Stephen Curry <laughs> <laughs> okay, watch and learn kids. Oh, 
all these like lame ass shots, you know. It's not literally, it's not, it, it like breaks down and you're, you're gonna count it. Alright, so that was fun. Uh, I've never done any sort of this kind of activity before. It's only five bucks per token. So you guys can come and check it out, spend some time with your friends, practice your swings. This is it's called Baseball Cage in Banda Putri Pucho. Feel free to check it out. It's right on top of Family Mart. Alright, we're back at Prime Kids Studio because we're gonna record. Basically, I have like a few songs I'm recording with him, but today we're gonna do this, the, the Fuck You song. I don't know if you guys remember. It's on my Instagram. I did with the ukulele and all the shit. We're gonna properly turn it into like a proper song. Fun fact, I wasn't actually playing the guitar. If, it, if you guys don't. <laughs> but yeah, we're gonna turn this into a proper, proper legit song. I think it's a damn good song. I feel like it's a damn good song. Today is going to be a little bit different. I brought my ukulele. We're going to figure out the chords. Uh, Nina is here to help us figure out the chords and then we're going to turn the whole thing into like a beat. So let's see how it goes. So uh, Nina is uh, an award Grammy winning award producer. She is with us trying to help us figure out the chords. I think uh, if you said Gram pianist, it would have been more. Grammy winning pianist. <laughs> uh, she has composed so a couple cool. of songs for uh, Celine Dion, Drake, John Legend. John Legend, she's like John Legend's personal pianist. So she's gonna figure out the chords. <laughs> okay, she's like playing the piano. Okay. What surprise things? Oh, not yet, lah. This is Sarah. Hey man, what's up? Of course, I know Sarah, man. I okay, show Sarah. him, show him the, show, 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 him show, the show. print. Show him the print. Show on the vlog. Alright, so this is it. Ah. Yo, yeah. hey, turn the camera. So you wanted camera to get it done Yo. for your shell. That is so cool, man. But now he's all emo because there's a 2 mm error. I said fuck it. What? Like it's gonna can be on the shell. See? Yeah. What's so, the 2 mm error? So you can't see it. Doesn't matter. So we made it for the shelf, lah. Hey, Sarah, thanks a lot, man. That looks so dope, man. At least like this, right? Uh, it will, it will look. Yeah. Uh, so this is three part assembled, you know. Oh, Simple it? assembly. So I'll, I'll show you how to do it la. Yo, that looks fucking nice, man. <laughs> and this one is actually like protruding out. So it's this main logo that actually will pull the eye. In. Yo, yeah. bro. Hey, uh, uh, unassemble it. Unassemble it. Yo, uh, hey, man. Come on, man. <laughs> Come on, man. Yo, that looks damn cool, man. That looks fucking, fucking cool, man. Hey, thanks a lot, man. How long did it take for you to do this? Yeah, designing a few hours, printing was about 24 hours. Uh. Yeah, six hours each piece. Six, uh, six or eight? Yo, Sarah, you got it. Um, one was eight, one was six, one was seven. Plus minus, time to sleep and everything. No, I feel, I'm, I feel like I'm guilty of that, man. Uh, <laughs> I give pluck. Pluck, uh, is there anything on the pluck? Yeah, yeah, yeah. we we'll link it in we'll the link. description below. <laughs> Come let me, let's, that's my work, I know how to tune the ukulele. Okay. Right, right, see? Uh, yeah, but it's a bit flat. Okay, and then we put the settings, then make sure it's like in the correct key, then we move on to the next parts. I don't know what the fuck you just said, but okay. <laughs> yeah, you see how it chopped? <laughs> okay. We record like that, part by part. Okay. Right. To make sure like each part sounds okay. in key. Okay. Yeah. In key or on key? On key. On key. On key. On key. Well, honky. <laughs> Alright, so now we have another uh, Grammy winning uh, ukulele playlist to help us with a song. Uh, you want me to Eve. send you on WhatsApp? Eve? Yeah, I can. Eve, uh, Hi. We just want to be talking about all this Grammy winning musicians. <laughs> <laughs> She's our second Grammy winning musician. So, musician. So basically, this song is just produced by super, super talented people. And the, the uke was tuned by like the most talented person in, yes, in this project. Uh, I think all of us are just equally talented. Okay. Even like Marvin's talented in his own equipment. Employee of the month. Employee of the month. <laughs> <laughs> Our Grammy winning uh, uke player is figuring out the chord. So we're giving her a space. Hard at work. So What's I think this might be the one. This one lah, the shift, shift, shift. Shift, shift, <laughs> the chord shift. Yo, you won't understand this, no worries. <laughs> I woke up in the morning and I'm thinking about what to do. The cage doesn't like animals in the zoo. What, what to do, what to do. Right guys, hope you guys enjoyed this vlog. And if you reached this point of the vlog, make sure you hit the like button and also subscribe if you guys haven't subscribed to the channel and hit the bell notification things to get notified whenever the vlog is up. And also, of course, Get yourself your Revit t-shirt at www.revitclothing.com I'll see you guys next Thursday. Every Thursday, we'll be posting up vlogs at 7.30pm. So, I'll see you guys next week, 7.30pm Thursday. 
Ciao. Do the riffs, you play Do the in riffs the keyboard. in piano instead. Nobody's asking my opinion. It's my song. Yeah. Nobody's asking my opinion. Oh, you can already.